Holy shit! The trailer for Captain America Civil War finally released. About freaking time, Marvel. What took you so long to release the trailer for this movie? One of my most anticipated movies for 2016. The trailer has finally come. It debuted on Jimmy Kimmel. So, of course, as a trailer review should be, I'm going to go ahead and talk about my thoughts on this trailer. And for this teaser, it starts off with Captain America and Falcon. They find Bucky. Captain America asks his Falcon if he remembers him. And then Bucky tells him how he knows his mother's name and all this stuff. But of course, because of all the horrible things that Bucky, a.k.a. the Winter Soldier, did in Captain America the Winter Soldier, the policemen are out looking for Bucky. So of course, you know what this means. Bucky is now out for the run. And so, with this trailer, we get an insight that Captain America is standing by Bucky's side, but everyone else doesn't think it's a good idea for him to go by Bucky's side because then Captain America has to face the consequences. Of course, you know who has to come, Iron Man. And that's when all the Civil War just begins to start. There's a huge disagreement and the trailer just gives us non-stop footages of just pure amazing action. We're gonna have some really serious drama that especially when you get towards the end in which I'm gonna get to that in a little bit. Even though we got a half second shot of the Black Panther I think that was really cool and the costume you don't really get to see much so I can't really comment on the costume, but I think it looked cool for the half a second shot that the trailer delivered us. And then of course, we have William Hurt, who played the general from The Incredible Hulk, actually come back here. And it's going to be so good to actually see a character from The Incredible Hulk actually return to connect in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. I think it's just cool for the trailer to give us teases of what we're expecting from this trailer. And then of course, as we reach to the end of the trailer, Captain America is telling Tony Stark, I'm sorry, Tony. You know I wouldn't do this if I had any other choice. But he's my friend. And then you see Tony sadly going, so was I. And then Captain America and Bucky are just beating the crap out of Iron Man. And it's very cool one take shot. And that's when it shows Captain America Civil War. Like, holy crap. You felt so bad. Like, no, no, that's not fair. Why Captain America? Why Bucky? Why did you have to beat up Tony to the ground like that? Like, oh man, I'm not gonna lie. That was kind of hard to watch because I love Tony. I love Iron Man. And in a way, I kind of want to be on Iron Man's side. You know, like, I get Captain America's point of view because Bucky was like not only his friend but his brother to him. So I get that. But then, you know, he did do a lot of bad things and the Winter Soldier so I can get Tony's point of view and, oh man, I am so excited to see where this film is going to go down. It just looks like the storyline is going to be interesting. We're going to get some serious stuff happening. Of course, we're going to get exciting action. The Winter Soldier, you know, Captain America the Winter Soldier is by far one of the best movies in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Um, the Russo Brothers, I have high hopes they will do great with Captain America Civil War. It is one of my most anticipated movies of 2016. Fantastic teaser trailer. So that is my trailer review for Captain America Civil War. So you guys, in the comments down below, let me know. What did you think of this teaser trailer for Captain America Civil War? And also, whose side are you on? Are you on Team Captain America's side or Team Iron Man's side? This is 22 Tiger Dude here, and don't forget that I will always have Tiger Power!